to you because I just I just said Paris instead of Faris. I said your name I said Paris instead of Faris. You know what I didn't even notice. You first didn't? Of all, I, then I didn't say it. <laughs> and I also love Paris. It confuses me but the city itself. I do love Paris too. The city. Does it confuse you? Paris does confuse me. Sometimes I think why Paris? Why? You know what I was thinking though? Um, I was trying to get, because I know you like your name said the right way. I know, it's so dumb. It's... My parents did this to me. I, it's not my fault. And I would think I'm being pretentious. No, no, you're not being pretentious. Uh... Are you kidding me? You're on a show where the guy's got uh, cockroach yeah. stains in it. <laughs> Look, it's a real thing. A cockroach I did wish that. you still had it. No, you do not! <laughs> it was so fr Aren't you afraid of beetles and bugs and uh, thingies? Ew. Well, if they were that big, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah they were my pants. No, I really, I totally squealed. Yeah, I was well, like, oh! How did it get there? Where did it come from? I don't know. I think probably the South. Yeah, the South. <laughs> yeah. I think it came up from South America somewhere. It had a kind of Latin flair about it. Oh. Yeah. Have you ever lived in New York for any length of time? A little bit. A right. Little bit. Well, you know you've seen bugs then, surely. Because yeah. I, I lived in New York, and that's the last time I saw a bug that size. Oh, yeah. They're kind of fun if you see them on the street. Yeah, on the street. Crunch. <laughs> Don't you think? <laughs> They make a nice... He doesn't mean it, country. people who love cockroaches. Oh, yeah, no, I no. don't at all. I've just heard this. No, no, you, you wouldn't do that. You keep no. them and raise them as your <laughs> own. <laughs> this, uh, this show uh, on CBS looks a little bit racy for CBS. I mean... Uh, yeah, I think so. Yeah. It's a little racy for my parents. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I meant. It's CBS, your parents, yeah. same thing. Of course. Uh, so it's, uh, but it's about two uh, women who are mother and daughter, who are both recovering alcoholics. Yep, um, both recovering addicts. Um, I, I'm raising um, two children, and uh, I'm a single mom, and... So this I, is still the show we're talking about. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> right. Um, yeah, so it's, we deal with some heavy issues. Well, well, that's... Hopefully with comedic flair. Well, <laughs> that's not entirely necessary, as I've found in CBS. You don't have to be that funny. <laughs> Just employ the CBS cockroach and you'll be fine. <laughs> Good. And then Cloudy with a Chance of Meatballs is awesome. I saw the first one. I oh, loved it. Oh, yeah, thank you. It's got Mr. T in it. I know. <laughs> I, it's, uh, I'm really excited to, uh, to have come back and... and you know, do a sequel. It's good doing. It's good doing cartoon films, isn't it? I like doing them. Yeah, because you don't have to put clothes on. Uh, and stuff. Yeah. And tired. you don't know what's going on half the time. Don't even it's read like, the script. No, it's no. Like, I don't know. Well, I get embarrassed because I do the. <clears throat> excuse me, I do them as well. And and when I turn up and the director <laughs> says, "So this is the scene where you know he finds out," and you're like, "Oh yeah." Of course. You know, in the earlier yeah. scene when that happened, I'm like, "Oh yeah." Mm -hmm. <laughs> So he's happy, sad, what is he, you know? Yeah, no, in, in Cloudy, it's interesting, too, because um, we're dealing, you know, they'll be like, okay, so you're walking through a bog made of syrup, so make that noise. <laughs> <laughs> make that noise, then? Okay, I, well, this is, I, I did a few different things. Right. Like, That's not bad. You think? Yeah, did you ever do peyote or mescaline? <laughs> of course. Well, Who hasn't? Well, right. Maybe yeah. that's where the... Maybe there was no cockroach. Maybe it was just... It was a flashback. The flashback. Oh, oh yeah. Relief. But then explain teeth marks in my pants. Oh, that may have been me. Oh. <laughs> We're going to have to do a dental match-up. You've got an extremely small mouth you have. <laughs> no, don't, don't. Don't, because <laughs> there could be cockroach spit right there. Oh, yeah. Aren't you a germaphobe? Everyone in Hollywood's a germaphobe. No. Really? No, I'm not. But, you know, my mom, um, she was 
af deathly afraid of spiders and other bugs. And she Jeez, got. I hated some... my day then. <laughs> but she was given some advice she, by this older lady. She said, don't pass it on to your kids. So then as a result, my brother and I have a kind of a weird thing with bugs. You like them? <laughs> yeah. You no. like bugs? Yeah. No, that's OK. It's a little weird. I'm not crazy about huge cockroaches in my pants. <laughs> I'll admit that. <laughs> Oh, you get to like it. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, we have to. Uh, we have to take a break. Oh, rats! <laughs> Not rats, too. <laughs> Did you ever see any rats when you lived in New York? A couple of times, I yeah, think. Me yeah, me too. Yeah. The big boys there. Oof, gee, I remember seeing one on Fourteenth Street subway. He had a hat on. Uh. <laughs> You're like, Hello. Morning. Welcome. It wasn't just like a regular hat. It was a hard hat. It was a construction <laughs> rat. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Do that again. Uh, wow. Uh, well, anyway, it's a commercial break. We'll be right back with... Okay. Uh, Yeah, we're back. We're back. So any real conversation can be put aside for a moment while we pretend to know each other like yeah. people in late night talk shows. <laughs> 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 yeah. <you>. Yeah. <laughs> Did you see Ashton when he walked out? Oh, <laughs> <yeah>. <laughs> Seriously, have you ever seen Ashton? <laughs> Yeah, well, yeah, I guess so. Yeah. I don't know if he's seen me, though. <laughs> what, is he short-sighted? I did hear that. I don't know, I don't know Yeah, about no, I think, I think he's got very bad eyesight. Oh, really? I don't know, this I just made it up. Just start yeah. rumors. That's how you start rumors. Do you know what, let me tell you, by tomorrow, there'll be a rumor going around Hollywood that I'm sexually attracted to cockroaches. Oh, uh, yeah. Well, there's always truth in rumors. Yeah, well, <laughs> no smoke without fire, I guess. <laughs> Oh, gosh, it was horrifying. I, I'm sorry for talking about it so much. I can't get over it. I, I got to tell you, I, I don't blame you. That really? is a pretty, that's pretty shocking. I don't yeah. know. Surprise you... in your pants. <laughs> I mean. Well, I think you may have been trying them on. Yeah. Oh, of course, yeah, yeah. <laughs> nice I'm try. like, yeah, nice try, six <laughs> legs. How's that going to work? <laughs> Where are you making the, uh, the sitcom? Is it Warner Brothers? Yeah, we're going, uh, yeah, oh, we're over at Warner Brothers. It's lovely over there. I made the Drew Carey show there. It's lovely. Yeah, and, you know, every time I go through the gate, uh, I just remember those days, of course, when I wasn't allowed. To it, come on the lot. Yeah. yeah. And then there was like the full, eventually when I could get an audition, there was like the body pat down, like, yeah. good luck. Yo, I you hate know. that. Don't you hate that? <laughs> yeah. The security guard. Yeah, good luck. Yeah, yeah. You'll end up a security guard yeah. like yeah. the rest of us. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's how I'm going to end up. Yeah, me too. Me like too. when you turn up at the yeah. lot to do your job, I'll be like, it's a great day for America <laughs> that you're here. <laughs> and I'll be like, I'm going to take over your shift now. I'm signing in, Craig. Here we go. <laughs> signing out. Signing out. Our future. Well, you know. Nah, I'd be all right. Yeah. Which stage are you on? What number? Stage 20. Oh, that's the good one. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> that's the good Have you been to that uh, commissary there? Yeah. Oh, it's awesome, isn't it? It's a great commissary. You got that great chicken. Yeah. <laughs> they, they, and they have like a whole... <laughs> they've got a whole deal. It's really... I don't know. I'm I saw a carrot top in there once. You did? Yeah. That's exciting. Ooh, yeah. I love, I love a carrot top. <laughs> You know, here's the thing about Carrot Top. You ever seen Carrot Top's show? Yeah, no. Right. Well, you go see it and you'll be like, you'll be like, oh, I'm not a prop. I don't like prop comedy. And then you go see Carrot Top's show, you'll be really like, good. this is really funny. He's really good. Prop is He's ginger, though. Stuff. Ginger. Yeah. yeah. Well. So he's got those ginger freckles. Yeah. That's where gingers keep the souls of their victims. <laughs> In their freckles. Do they murder people? Oh, I'm not saying they do or they don't. <laughs> Another rumor. Going out there. <laughs> Going out there. Along with me being sexually attracted to bugs. Yeah. <laughs> bugs. I said bugs in a very odd way there. <laughs> bugs. I think the cockroach in my pants moved and I went bugs. Bugs. Like 
Anyway, we're out of time. Do you, uh, what do you find? Uh, awkward pause, perhaps? Or a uh, fake argument? You want to twerk with a horse? How do you want to get I, out of I, here? I like the, I, either therapist or awkward pause. Will you choose? Yeah, let's do a quick therapy. Okay, great. Okay. Nervous, though. It's your mother. Okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, so, doctor, you know, I think why I'm so messed up is because my parents' goal in life was to keep me a virgin forever. Is this real? <laughs>